walls start in relatively shallow water and plunge down to infinity. Although they still have their famous stinger tails, they only seem to strike in self-defense, usually when stepped on in shallow water or when caught in a net or on a hook. Hundreds of divers have visited this site with no reported stings. A few have developed welts from the ray's powerful mouths as they miss the mark for food. The rays seem to love being fed by divers and having their undersides rubbed. They feel like satin pillows. South Sound is perhaps the least dived area because the prevailing southeast winds can fuel waves booming over the shallow reefs. But the sunlit water and the turbulence does induce massive elkhorn colonies. When the south side is diveable, it's worth a trip because it's so different than the rest of the island. a few operators come here and many sites remain unnamed. In fact, when we visited the island, the Marine Parks Department was